Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm CC SLC Gamer, bringing you another video. And today I want to talk to you guys about some recent movie news that people have been posting lately. And in this discussion, I'm going to be talking about the new horror Pinocchio movie that now just went public domain. And also breaking down some new set photos of what Johnny Cage will look like with Carl Urban in the second movie. And even talking about some crazy live action stuff that they're doing with these animated movies. So without further ado, let's get into it. <clears throat> so first off, I wanna to talk to you guys about the new live action movies that they're making. So at the beginning, we did hear the news from Dwayne Johnson that he would be playing a live action Maui, but most recently people have been posting this all over the world regarding the director for How to Train Your Dragon, who is going to be returning to direct the live action movie for it, if you could believe that. And if you want to know my personal opinion, I don't know why they decide to like do all these great animated movies into live action but based from the knowledge that we've gotten like what the cast is i'm willing to give it a chance my only hope is they at least bring back the same person who did the music because that person nailed it with the music but if we look here how to train the dragon live action cast And it's revealed here that they found their live action Hiccup and Astrid. And for Hiccup, they'll be having Mason Thames be him. And they'll have Nico Parker play Astrid. Now Mason, I don't really recognize that much. But I did overhear that Nico Parker was to, believed to be part of the Last of Us series. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe that's what I heard. And then they have the original actor who played Stoic, Hiccup's father, returning to play him, Gar Geralt Bustler. I think that's what his name is. I know it's like Gerland. Yeah. Gernard Bust Bustler. So he's returning as Stoic. And then it was revealed that Nick Frost is the one who's going to be playing Gobber. So some hopes here. They did pull out a good cast for it, especially since they're like having young actors be Hiccup and Astrid but with the movie just revealing Hiccup and Astrid I am kind of hoping they bring the rest of the gang in this like Snout Lout, Fish Legs, Rough and Tough Nut because those guys also made the movie really good too and not only is this going to be happening with How to Train Your Dragon it's officially out there that any classic animated movie can now be turned into a live action movie. Which, I don't know why they would decide to go to that. Because it seems like now there's possibilities of like a live action Incredibles movie or a live action Shrek. Which, I would be fine with the Incredibles, but... I don't know, I'm so attached with the animated movie that I don't think I would even want to see a live-action version of The Incredibles. And Shrek, of course, is perfect the way it is, so hopefully no one touches Shrek. <clears throat> and now I want to talk to you guys about some Mortal Kombat 2 news and also some other movie news that have been popping up lately. So, for starters, I want to show you guys this picture of what 
Johnny Cage's belt would look like in the movie. And of course, it's still the same as we saw at the end of the first movie. The belt's the same, and it's the same version that he wore in Mortal Kombat 11, if you could believe that. But no official picture yet of Carl Urban actually looking like Johnny Cage. I mean, I'm happy that they at least showed what the belt looks like. I'm glad they're taking on that angle, but without a full picture of what he looks like with like the glasses and the handsome hair and all that, it's hard to want to see the movie if I don't know what they look like. And going back to the live action stuff, it was revealed by Paramount that they are in the works of making a Danny Phantom movie, which is a popular TV show for the kids on Nickelodeon. And I didn't grow up with Danny Phantom that much, so I don't know too much about it, but I do know the story is like Danny, like having getting like these ghost powers that can like actually turn him into a ghost but he's still like human so could definitely see some hope there but just don't know who they would want to be danny phantom because if danny's like a kid then i feel like they should have like a young actor be danny and probably just not like have a young adult purse in like in their 25 to 30 age be Danny Phantom because I feel like that's just gonna ruin the joy for it. <clears throat> and even the news with the Minecraft movie is going a little bit wild because ever since they announced that Jack Black is turning is being part of the cast for this live action Minecraft movie. People are wondering about what the designs look like and people are kind of going with an ugly Sonic vibe here because, well, for one live action, the characters who are playing these guys are not gonna be the same as we know them from like the game itself, which kind of has me one worried on how the minecraft movie is even gonna go and if and if they're still gonna be like having jack black still be part of it it's gonna be wondering so much on where the movie is gonna take because if they're like saying the movie is like going to an ugly sonic vibe then it's probably not gonna be the best movie that we've ever seen from the video game franchise. Hmm. Let's see. And last thing I want to talk to you guys about is the new horror Pinocchio movie that is currently in development. Now, sure, they want to keep this expansion up, and plus that's what they told us. But I'm still not having too much hope with all these movies because, sure, the first Winnie the Pooh horror movie was good. They even had a sick poster for it. But that's not where the most interesting part is. In this article talking about the Pinocchio movie and this picture right here of what they showed... They stated that these drawings are going to appear at the end of the second movie. And it will be teasing out the expansion of the universe that they're making. Even the name itself, Pinocchio Unstrung, makes sense. He's a puppet. And kind of sounds a little bit funny when I think about it. <clears throat> But not only are they doing Pinocchio, I'll remind you of these two other movies that they're doing. They're going to be doing Bambi, The Reckoning, and Peter Pan's Neverland Nightmare. 
And right now, they are starting to film Bambi Reckoning right now. And they even posted out this picture of the Bambi movie. It doesn't show much of like Bambi or anything else, but it's a little news alert that they're starting to develop the movie. But all in all, that's all I have for you guys here today. Comment down below what you thought of the horror Pinocchio news and any of the other stuff I mentioned. You guys have a good night, and I will see you guys next time. See ya!